This is more nerve-wracking for me than the phone, maybe. All right, three, two, one. The S7 Edge has one of the best screens we've seen in a phone. But the ample real estate and sexy curves mean it's also one of the most fragile. In comes the Note 7. Same dimensions and curved AMOLED screen, but with what's perhaps a sturdier glass. It's the first phone sporting Corning's Gorilla Glass 5. So does this make it a sturdier phone? That's why we're here. So, you want to do the yep, honors? I'll go first. Right. So I'm going at about two, two feet. feet. Okay, here we go. Oh. Three, two, one. Okay, it has chalk all over it. <laughs> My beautiful bullseye. But it totally survived. Nice. Here it is. Two feet. My knees. Yeah. My knee height. Just about. Okay. One. Bullseye. Two. Woo! That sounded so bad. <laughs> oh! We got a winner. We got a winner. Next up, we're dropping it from pocket height. Here we go. Oh. Three, two, Oh! <laughs> and it landed screen up so we know it survived. Yes. All right, little, okay. little note seven. Let's do this. Pocket height. A little bit higher. Higher? Yep. There? Yep. Three, two, one. Oh, it also landed face first. Whoa. Or, face, face first up, and then face flipped up. over, belly up. 1.6 meters is what Corning says that Gorilla Glass 5 can withstand when it's not altered. So that's why we're going to this height, not because we take selfies, but. Okay, here we go. You should take a selfie. Before, right? <laughs> All right, three, two, one. Oh, wow. You're a good little guy. Wow. 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 Well, nothing? No, nothing. nothing. This is more nerve-wracking for me than the phone, maybe. All right, three, two, one. Perfect landing. I can't handle that sound. Okay, moment of truth. Moment of truth. Oh. Oh, wow. Look at this, it's very dramatic. It's got chalk all over it, but it's still rolling. Still perfectly fine. Now that we know it can survive face first, both phones, it's time to test the edge. So we're going to go pocket height, which is probably the most common place. It gets dropped on the edge in three, two, one. Oh, did it land on the edge? Not really, but. Should we do it again? Yeah. Okay. Maybe do it like. Oh! <gasps> oh no! no! It's so ruined. It's so ruined. I like it how we were going to drop yeah, it again, yeah. but it's so ruined. So we're going to test out the Note 7 from pocket level on the side. Three, two, one. Did that? So why? We're going to do uh, selfie level 1.6 meters from the side. All right, so three, two, one. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Was there a crack on the back? No. It's still good. It's still going. <gasps> no. See? You're right. There is a crack. There's a crack. So it did break, but just a little bit in the corner and in the back. So we're going to keep going. And I'm going to drop it with a crack facing up. Love Three, it. two, one. Whoa. Still good. Still good. It well, let's see the back. The back. Oh. 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 The back is. Oh. Spider webs everywhere. Oh. Take a look at that. Oh, poor baby. So after multiple drops in different angles, the back of this is completely destroyed. But the front is intact. It's perfect. Which is what you really care about. Yeah. Unlike this phone, where the front is destroyed, but the back <laughs> is perfect. So if I had a choice, Note 7. Note 7, baby. Three, two, one.